Hello you, welcome to Geekism, and welcome back to Mega Aquarium, where we're cracking on with our biggest aquarium yet, the uh, the one that started at the theatre, I forget the name of it. Uh, but I thought we'd have a little walk through and see where we're up to at the moment. So we have a few little simple uh, tanks as we come in, and little fishies. We tried to keep it to, uh, to be a single fish type to each tank to start off with. I'm quite happy with how that looks, to be honest, especially when there's loads of them in here like this. I think these shoaling fish look look really, really good. This one's actually going to get moved, because eventually what we're going to do is have the thing a complete circle, and that's actually going to be the gift shop that you can either just walk in if you're interested, or you're going to have to walk through to leave, okay? Here's some more little cute fishes. Not very good at what the fishes are, I don't know. Here's a big spotty thing, look. Big old arrows on the floor. Uh, take us past these. These are like... Um, like, a bit like discus type, I don't know. <laughs> I used to keep tropical fish, but I'm so out of the loop. It's been so long, I completely forgot. Here's another. Oh, angel! These are angel fish, aren't they? Little ready ones. They're cute. They're cute. I like these big tanks we'd like to see. And here's our first shark, technically, sort of, kind of. They're uh, little sharks that hang around on the floor and all bunch up and look a bit weird. And then we come down here into. What were you? Oh, puffer fish. Look at the spiky, spiky. Oh, no, not puffer fish, sorry. Uh, Lionfish. Ooh, lionfish. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Who's that up there? I was a member of staff feeding them. Okay. And then we move into our beautiful tropical uh, area here where we put in some starfish and a few other little bits. And then we have these two empty ones here ready for some. Uh, oops. Ready for some coral. Oh, we've got uh, feeding. Let's have a look. Learn. No, you're, you're our awesome fixer, aren't you, Mako? Yeah, there you go. Uh, right, so we're going to put some coral in here, so we're going to need some lamps to do the coral, I think. So let's move you around there, just because uh, you look better that way. And then here we go, power light 10. Um, probably basic light will do of these, to be honest with you. We'll put them on and we'll see. Um, and then we'll put the fish in. So here we go, we've got some blue tubular sponge. These... Oh, these do grow. Oh, we've got a male there. Oh, seven. That's got to be stuff growing, hasn't it? Yeah. Doop, 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 doop. Lionfish have grown, and the sharks have grown. Let's just go and check they're okay now, then. No, they need a little bit more filtering, as do you guys. So, um, let's see what we can just... Can we just squeeze a filter on here? And will it be enough? No, that did absolutely nothing. Nice. Okay, so... Uh, how do we fix this? Let's um, yeah, we can get away with that. So let's put a. Oh no, we can't. No, it still needs to be hotter. Uh, let's try that. Oh man, this is hard work. Ah, I know what we could do. We could put some rocks in there. They you help a little bit with filtering. Don't you? Please? No. Oh. Tank is not sufficiently heated. Low water quality is reducing the health of animals in the tank. Remove some animals or add more filter. I mean, I guess we could sell a fish, couldn't we? Rather than have three of each. Let's sell one of the big dudes. There we go. It's no longer a problem. Okay, and then over here... We can we can sell a sharky shark. I'm sorry, sharky shark, but you gotta go. There we go. Everyone seems happy, apart from the fact that we messed that up. Um, so let's just put that back in. You still not enough now. Oh. We got rid of a fish. Let's try a let's try a power. There we go. That's a lot of stuff to do. That isn't it? Uh, one thing that I've heard a few people say that they that they're not mega happy about with the game, and it's not really the game. It's it's kind of a, an issue with this kind of genre in general. They have this like they have this sort of like size creep, where you know they're just like here's the size of a two filter, so you need seven of them, you know, and it's that's, that's a bit of a weird mechanic that wouldn't happen in real life they would just get a more efficient filter you know it might be slightly bigger but you wouldn't have them all lined up like this would you but you know that's that's how this game works that's how a lot of uh tycoon games work management game works so i'm not a major issue with it but i do agree that 
you know, you can get it is a mega aquarium game. You know, the idea is that it's going to be a big old aquarium, but it would be quite nice to see how you can do in a smaller space. Uh, okay, they're all in. So yes, what we were doing, coral, of course. Coral, blue tulipin. Let's have a look. These grow to uh, will grow to four after three days. All right, and they're currently one. I guess. Soft coral, they eat zooplankton, they eat zooplankton, and they're soft coral as well. So I think we should probably have these in, in separate, uh, oh, they require light, they require tank with 10 or more light. So actually, these aren't good enough. These have only got five. So get rid of them and put them in. Apparently there's a bit of a bug in the game at the moment. If you don't, if you don't, uh, um, research the big lights. You, there's a coral that you need to you get given, and it, it all gets messed up, and it's all awful, and people cry, and there's a plane coming in, and it's horrible. Uh, right, here we go. Let's zoom in so we can see what we're doing. Blue tubular sponge. Here we go. One. Uh, what's up? I'm gonna say. I reckon we could probably do three. Uh. It's difficult to tell, isn't it? Because they don't really seem to take up much space. Let's um, let's pop the combi stuff on that we need, and they'll, they can obviously get fed the stuff they need as well. Zooplankton, there it is. Um, we'll probably end up chucking a couple of fish in there. We're going to have to, aren't they? You're not going to just go and look at coral, are you? And uh, Daisy Star Polyps, they grow a little as well. So let's do... Oh, they look cute. There we go. What's up with you? Are you, you yeah, you're not heated and stuff, are you? Let's... Uh, power Combi, then. You don't quite have enough water filtration. That's interesting. Which you should have. Now, my problem is, I think, is chucking fish into there is going to completely mess it up. But we've got to put something in there, haven't we? What about one of those really simple, easy things? Like that. Just a couple of them. Just... Um, oh, we don't have any oblique line dotty backs. Oh, I'll tell you what then. Cancel this. These, come on, you're coming with me. I'm going to carry one static object at a time, that's fine. Come on then. You've just become coral. And you're going to like it. Okay, and then you are going to be a oblique. Um, fighting. Oh, we can only have one of you and stuff, can we? Let's have a look. Oh, you can't be with your own kind. Oh. Well, in that case, <laughs> let's move them all back. <laughs> uh, you need, you just need some stone. Okay, well, you can just have some little stones. All right, look at the time. Look at the state of it. You better grow look and look awesome and big. All right, let's do that. A little bit of uh, eel grass in there. And a little bit of, uh, no, not eel grass actually. What's up with this? Oh, you're not quite filtered enough. Of course you're not. Uh, okay, we can move you. Put you next to that one. Meaning we can then stick a power filter on there. Beautiful. Let's give us three new types of fish. And we're now up to 14. Here's the deal. All right? Here's the rub. Here's the rub. We've got six of them, we've got eight of them, we've got one of them, we've got 20 of those. We haven't got any coral groupers. We haven't got any unicorn sturgeon fish. 16, 12. We haven't got any flame angel fish. We haven't got any coral beauties. Uh, so, we haven't got any, loads of these actually. God, but there's loads we haven't got any of. So, let's have a look. One, two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven, 
Seven we haven't got would give us 21. Yeah, so we just need to build in all of these, basically. Coral groupers. You don't like to be... Um, you, you, you're a loner, aren't you? All right. We're going to build... So, so what we're going to do here is we're going to have a... We're going to carry on this area here. And we're going to have a corridor here, basically, that just does all, a few of these little ones. All right. Uh, guests want large animals. Fully grown unicorn sturgeon fish. Surgeon fish, a fully grown epaulette shark, which we have, and a fully grown ballon rasp, which I think we also have that actually. Yeah, so we so unicorn surgeon fish. There we go. Autopsy report eaten by Atlantic pollock. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh well, that's fine, I guess. I didn't realise they would, he would eat them, but whatever. <laughs> we only put him in there to feed the uh, to feed the um, those things anyway, didn't we? Right, let's <laughs> let's sort out some of this. Uh, let's lock this area off. Oops. Like that. Uh, are we going to have to do that one one there? And then move you. I really like the blue tubular. Uh, this aquarium is clean inside it. Yeah, it is. You're, you're great. You're great. I love you. Okay. Let's pretty much... Oh, I don't know whether I want to go right to there. I mean, we might as well, haven't we? Let's do that then. Let's open all this up and then we'll fix it with walls. Okay. Yeah. So we need some. I'm going to go for little tanks. I want to go deep because um, I don't like the uh, the not deep ones. But I do want to kind of do them like this. Let's have a bit more space here. Uh, nope. So we're going to go bench, bin, bench, tank. All right. And then we're going to drag yo there, and we're going to drag yo there. And then we're going to come up to our lovely blue paint, and we're going to paint all this in so we know what we're doing. I'm going to keep it super simple. After some quite intense tankage, <laughs> we're going to um, we're going to keep this area pretty simps, tote simps. All right, let's do this. Let's do all of that there. Okay. So these need to be fed from above. So we'll do that and that and that and that. Uh, okay, and you're gonna need let's put the fish in so who's the first one we need that we need that unicorn surgeon fish There we go. You grow up to 18. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 48 or more. I, d I don't know. Is that okay? Let's have a look temperatures too low not filtered not heated and no tank. Yeah, so size wise you're okay All right, let's pause that up then and let's get you sorted. So a power combi 736 should be enough Yep, and what else do you need? Lack, oh no, lack of swimming space. Um, so now you need to be bigger. All right, well, tell you what then. Let's get rid of you and you and the whole thing there. And let's build a bigger deep wall tank. And let's move you from there to there. And let's move you to there. Tell me you're okay now. Water temperature's too low. Because oh, you need a bit more heating. That's fine. We can totally cope with that. Um, and you just need some plants. Nice. Okay. Um, kelp. We're loving it. Loving the kelp. Loving the kelp. Okay. And you need something else in there because you look boring, don't you? Let's do. Um, oh, let's let's have a play around with some of this stuff. Ancient cave. Do you know what? Yeah, let's um, let's find where that kelp is. Let's move you to there, and let's put an ancient cave in. Yeah, just because it looks cool. What does that give us? Anything? Oh, we got a nice bit of prestige off it. Good. Uh, you need to get fed green pellets. 
So we might as well start a new run of uh, new run of food, probably along there. Actually, no, it won't, because there's a lot of space. We could probably get some secondary tanks along here, because this is going to be... Let me have a little think. Where No, here's going to be the exit. We're going to move this whole thing to over here, which we can do now as well, actually. And that's going to be the gift shop. Right, okay. Look at that one little bit of odd paper there. That's really weird, isn't it? In fact, let's do it then, so we can see what we're up to. Choo, 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 choo. How... Why do you? One, two, three, four, five. You're five long. So let's go there. Um, no, let's put you there. Oh, but then that one's going to be needing a move as well, isn't it? Huh, let's um, let's have a little think about this. All right, let's get rid of you. Right, move you to somewhere that you fit. I mean, you could just go there. It's a bit funky, but it kind of, you know, it fits. Um, or do we make more of a thing of it and pull you to like here? Right, I'll tell you what we'll do. Yeah, let's put you Let's put you there. All right. And then we'll get rid of that and that and that and that and that. Yes, yes, yes. Sell and that. Yes, sell. Okay. And then we'll redo the wall there. Okay. And then we'll add in a wallage here okay with this this is this is a thing this is a thing it's okay all right then we're gonna put you back in there um, okay and then we're gonna come to here we're gonna stick some toilets in here to make it look like it almost makes sense all right and then we'll come and paint this area in so shipwreck paint is this one uh, all of you should wreck paints, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. And then we'll come back into here. Uh, that one. And a couple of benches. And a bench here. And a fizzy old fizzy old drink there chocolate mini machine there and they've kind of got like a weird sort of side area that will do fine okay and then that area is going to be gift shop later on so we haven't had to move that much stuff and we've got a couple of blocks of toilets and everything else we need and the whole backstage area here is all copacetic and makes sense and we just have to paint this and we're good to go I think everything's still running Everything's still running. Good stuff. All right. So he's in there or she's in there. Unicorn Surgeon Fish. This space is now no longer wasted as much as it was. So let's put the food in. Uh, I don't know why I click around like that. I'm sorry. It probably winds a lot of people up. Um, let's put food in there. Let's put all the other gear in that we have here as well. Sponge sink because there are toilets there. And it's all stage. There we go. And then the food can carry along there as we need it. So that's that done. All right. Now, another fish that we haven't got already. Let's have a look. Six, eight, one, twenty. Coral grouper. You're going to be a big old swimmer. You're greedy. You only need a. You need a rubbish water quality. You're going to be pretty big. Only nine actually. Can't be. Yeah, you're a loner, aren't you? Yeah, you're going in there. Boom. Okay. Water temperature is too low. I reckon a power combi should probably do see you fit. Yeah. And you need a cave. Let's just do a drift or cave. Yeah, I'm gonna keep you you're one of these you get these occasionally, don't you? These like fish that are just 
in a pretty small tank on their own, chilling, looking all right, but not looking great. Yeah, and you need what do you need? You need mussels food. Uh, mussels. Oops, you can go there. Okay, now we need a bit of an easier way of getting into this area for our staff. So we're actually gonna we're gonna get rid of that door there, or that wall even. Turn it into a door. Uh, yeah. Okay, with that, I just realised we've got no wall here anymore. And there, that's fixed. Okay, so that's where the corridor continues. Let's um, let's demolish that, and let's get a couple of our freaky arrows in. Need one like here somewhere, don't we? Because they come through here. All right, so let's go there, there, and eventually there as well. But at the moment, it's a dead end. But that's fine. Um, it did does mean we've messed up our bench layout that we were going to have. I was going to do bench bin bench, but we'll do bench bench. <laughs> um, and bin, and bin. There we go. How's that? So let's get a look back on our main one here. Uh, ranks going up there. Yeah, good. 16 of the 21 animals now. This one, once it's fully grown, is going to give us a base of 200. It's going to hopefully get us up to... Look, I mean, look at this. Look where we're going, look where we're going here. Look at all this stuff. Podium. Wow. A small tunnel tank. That's going to be our big finish, isn't it? And more fish. Headsets. Podiums. Oh, mega, mega heater, compass, decorations, cannons that we had before and lost, balloon shelf, I assume that's for the gift shop, oh yeah, we need to get up to a thousand here, we need to do it badly, um, reach rank seven, that's what it's telling us to do, that's what it's telling us to do, and that's going to really help I think, so we need to try and, um, we need to try and fill out the space we've got now really, I think, rather than just keep adding on areas because we're going to end up with a giant of a place so let's open this up right uh, let's pause a moment to really regroup and we'll put the walls back in all right in fact let's just get rid of that row there because that's going to be a bit annoying otherwise there we go and um, we'll paint it blue so we can see the space that we've got to work with what i'm trying to do is is Again, just kind of bear in mind the idea of, of neat backstages, or at least, you know, more serviceable backstages than, than just sort of having a... What I don't want is a backstage for every fish, you know? That's that that's the, the key thing that I'm very aware of. I don't just want to make backstages for every type of fish. So, let us get some little baby fishes in here. Three. Three. All right. Small tanks. I'm gonna go little baby fishes. There's got to be there's got to be a few little fish we can stick into here, and and you know they're they're like side fish. Like people are all looking over here, and there's like oh we're here as well. Don't forget us. And everyone's like no, shut up, you're rubbish. Here, look these ones here. Flame angel fish. You can't be with your own kind. So we could put one of you in. You don't have to shoal. You can't be with your own kind. You don't have to shoal. Right. Boom. Flame angel fish. Boom. Coral beauty. Alright, so what's up with you? First of all, you need the old uh, power combis. Should be more than enough for both of you. Uh, you both need some plants. That's cool. You can have a couple of those. You can have... Yeah, you can have a couple of those. Feeling generous. In fact, I'll even go as far as saying you both can have a couple of little rocks as well. Because they're nice like that. You both need green pellets. Uh, we haven't got green pellets down here, but we can get them in. There we go. That is an easy... I mean, I know there's just one fish in there and everyone's like, what? Really? One fish? But um, I think that works out quite nice. They're rare, you know? Everyone's like, oh, look at that. It's a really pretty fish on its own. Okay, let's push up to 18. We need three more. 
to really help with that last bit of prestige. Hopefully, well, that's going to help. Once unicorn fish, uni, yeah, it is unicorn. Why do I, what am I saying? Coral grouper, where are you? Here. How are you getting on? Size 8. Growth time increases by 1 each day. Up to 8. You're going to be a monster by the time you're finished. Um, oh, I'm sorry you died. I am. R.I.P. Right. Fully grown surgeon fish. We're waiting. Surgeon. Surgeon fish. Sturgeon fish is what I keep saying. There we go. I, I knew I was saying one of the words wrong. Um, we win. When we hit that rank there. So reach rank 7. We're getting there. I still think we need a little bit of a push. But to be honest with you. That there gives us 200 base prestige. And we're nearly at 900. So personally I'm going to sit and wait. I'm going to wait it out until old surgeon fish here is uh, is fed. Ah, we did it without the surgeon fish. We got to uh, level 7. Which opens a whole load of stuff. We get podiums. Uh, a new plant, uh, some live rocks. Uh, oh, nice zooplankton built into them. Better filtration right out of the box. Nice. We get a cool compass, a cannon, and the mic headset that goes with the podium, I think, for doing uh, talks and stuff. So I think next episode, that is definitely what we're going to do. We're going to get this small tunnel tank unlocked as well. Oh, look at it. Um, let's go. Here we go. Look, staff talks. Now you're rank 7, you have access to the podium and mic headset. These allow you to schedule staff talks. Staff talks allow you to generate additional points. The type of point depends on the talk. The choice of talk depends on what animals are in the nearby tanks. To place your podium carefully. The number of points earned depends on the talking skill of the staff member and the number of guests that are nearby. Complete the new optional objective by putting in your first talk, which is what we are going to do in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries... Or suggestions, you can pop down in the comments if you fancy a chat. You can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you'd like to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so over on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find the link in the description. And uh, come on, then tell me what you want to do. I won't even click the button. I won't even click the button until next episode. What do you want to see next? Ooh, it's like cat. It's like um, a catchphrase, isn't it? You always get that top corner. You want that one, don't you? But you always get that one. Rubbish.